So greetings. Four weeks, that was it, and he was gone. I'm talking about Bruce Smith. You might have seen the previous video. He was diagnosed with cancer four weeks ago, and he died. Just like that. We just don't know, do we, when our time is up. And you know, when we're on our deathbed, like Bruce was, that we're either going to be in a place of fear and resentment and feeling like we're a failure. And to me, that would be absolute hell, being in that place, on my deathbed, the end of my life. Or we're going to be at the other extreme end, which is going to be in a place of faith and peace and fulfillment. Uh, because, you know, we had a great life. We, uh, we took risks. We lived on purpose. We uh, loved freely. We did all those things. And we felt great and we were maybe even happy to go, especially if your faith is strong. Uh, and so we don't know when it's going to happen. It could be tomorrow. We just do not know. For Bruce, it was four weeks. And, you know, it really begs the question, you know, where do we want to be? Uh, you know, and in your life in fear or in, in faith and fulfillment and peace. And so that they says, well, how are we living today? Because it could happen tomorrow. And, you know, it takes great courage to live life fully. And courage is simply defined as taking action in the face of fear. We have lots of fears these days, don't we? We have, especially about the economy and all kinds of things and personal fears. I can relate to this personally. I've lived most of my life in fear. And courage is simply taking action in the face of that and having the courage to love fully, having the courage to follow our heart, to be on purpose, to, uh, to live fully, to have maybe a courageous conversation, uh, to really leave a legacy. So what kind of legacy do you want to leave with your life? Bruce left the legacy of love for his life, giving and serving. And so I'd like to challenge you and encourage you to, to make some decisions about living more fully. To, uh, for example, to saying to your, your spouse, your loved one, your partner, hey, I love you. To your kids, I love you. To your friends and associates, hey, I really love you, man. You know, and to really make some decisions about how do you want to follow your heart and not just stay in a place where it's comfortable and secure and financially secure but really stretch and, and go, go for it in terms of what you truly want to be doing with your life, living on purpose, with passion. And maybe have a courageous conversation. Who is someone in your life right now that you need to tell the truth to, that you need to fess up to, that you need to speak your truth and, and maybe overcome some conflict and get some more alignment? Who is that in your life right now? So I, want, I really want to challenge you and encourage you because we don't know when our time is coming uh, and to make a commitment to yourself and maybe commit to someone else to go ahead and take some action. Step out in courage. Say I love you. Um, have a courageous conversation. Walk your talk and live on purpose. So go for the challenge and live fully today.